In the heart of the night, this world were bright, we would set it light. In the heart of the night, in the heart of the night, this world were bright, we would set it light. In the heart of the night. I'm Anthropomantic Fiend, and I do horror-related things on the internet. And today I'm going to be reviewing uh, No One Could Protect Her, which is a 1997, I believe, made-for-TV movie, and it's based on a true story, which automatically makes me really uncomfortable every single time I see a movie, but I think for this movie, it was important to be out of your comfort zone a little bit. This movie follows a couple who are living in their day-to-day -day life, and then the wife gets assaulted by this guy who we gradually discover is this sort of serial killer rapist guy, and the entire movie is them trying to piece together who he is, where he's going to strike next, and get rid of him. And I thought it was a really well done movie. The acting and character development was pretty great all around, especially the two main characters, the couple, because they, following the attack, start to drift apart, and they can't really live a normal life anymore and both sort of blame each other for becoming obsessed with trying to catch the killer and are lamenting the fact that they can't do normal things anymore despite the fact that they're both obsessed and it's a really interesting dynamic that they eventually have to overcome to go after the guy and it's I thought it was really, really well done. The scenes where the guy is sneaking into places and you don't know where he is and he's going to attack somebody, those are all extremely well done. Very tense. Uh, yeah, this is going to be a really short review. I don't have much to say about this movie except that it was good. Very effective, tense scenes. The character dynamic was great. The main characters, well, all the characters were just a little bit generic, but didn't matter. They were still characters that I felt attached to. This is a really good movie, just not a very fun one to watch because it's true events and all this really nasty stuff, but I thought it was good. I recommend it. I don't really have anything else to say about this one, so I will see you next time.